Welcome today, 2,393 of what you have to know. Sharon Hornell from here, documenting my journey, sharing lessons learned, sharing the good, the bad, the ugly, the things that work, the things that I flopped on my face on in the hopes that other people will learn from my mistakes and not make the same ones. There's plenty of mistakes to go around. We can create our own and learn from them. But if we can learn from other people's mistakes, that is one of the fastest, easiest ways to create the life we want, to create the business we want, to show up in the world the way we want, to create the best possible version of ourselves as people is by learning from other people's mistakes so we don't have to make those same mistakes ourselves. Well, today in the Let's Grow Annual Challenge, we are talking about confidence growth, of course, this entire month, and the impact of the thought, the knowing, the belief, the value that we create our own lives. We are individually 100% responsible for creating our life. Nobody can do it for us. We can't abdicate responsibility. I mean, we can, we do sometimes, we do things and we let other people drive our behavior and our reactions and how we respond and how we grow. Usually when that's happening, our personal growth and development is stunted and we're not creating our own life. When we, we can always choose not to, but why would you? If you want freedom, we need to be willing to take the responsibility and the consequences and all of the results that happen by embracing freedom it takes us being responsible for our actions our choices our thoughts our beliefs our our shortcomings right nobody can personally develop us for us they can teach us stuff we can learn we can read books we can study we can take courses we can have coaches but no matter how good the coach is it's 100 percent up to us to do the things that they advise or to use the tools that they suggest or to figure out what is and isn't for us. Uh, I've had dozens of coaches throughout my lifetime and we each pick and choose what it is that we need and learn from those individuals. And sometimes when we're going through a program, we are learning it, but we're tucking it away in our subconscious for when we actually need to apply it. Other things, we're getting a coach or a program or a course or reading a book to solve a current problem. And so we'll apply those things right away. I have found that the things that I learn and I apply in some way, shape or form right away are the ones that stick with me because they get a stronger place in my brain. So when I need them, they're right there at the ready. That's why I like to share certain tools with people because I have found them to be so transformational and so uh, transformationable, transformational and valuable, I want to make sure that I'm sharing them. I share them with my kids. I share them with my family. I share them with my friends. I share them with my clients because they're the things that have worked for me. Now, do they work for everybody? No. And, and people will say, this is my latest, greatest strategy or framework, and it works for everybody. I call BS because I have yet to find something that actually works for everybody. Now, right now, that's kind of a an oxymoron because I'm actually sharing in my Supersize Your Business group fundamental business strategies that apply in just about every industry. Do they 100% apply to every industry, every business? No, because I don't even know all the creative businesses that people can come up with. But anything that is a fundamental skill will help us to become a better version of ourselves, both in our life and in our business, no matter what. But we have to be the ones that step forward and say, I'm going to become a better version of myself. I'm going to learn this or I'm going to find somebody that's an expert in this and join forces with them so we can add this to our business. We all have limited capabilities and limited time, right? We don't know how long we're going to be here. It's why the first thing that I share as a fundamental strategy is write stuff down, document it, so that if something happens, your business doesn't necessarily die. When something happens in your life, yet there's a whole, if you die, there's a hole and a void created in your family, but hopefully they can still function without you. That's the same is true of our businesses. So that's all I've got today. It's Saturday here, so it's another weekend. Summer weekends, we're running out of them, so they're busy, busy times. But if I can help you in any way, all you have to do is ask. That's what I'm here for. Have an awesome day. Of course, be with you tomorrow.